Yes, so, yes! So happy more people are requesting it. And yeah, you want to request a character with the Omnitrix? PayPal and Cash App are in the bio. But for you, you gave me 15 bucks. So here is if Molly McGee had the Omnitrix. I've never heard of this show. So I did my research and she has no powers. There was an episode where she became a ghost and I kind of based it more off of that and her personality. So let's get to it. Her first alien is going to be Ghost Freak, because ghosts! And that's the exact same reason I decided to give her Big Chill, because pretty much if you deal with ghosts, you're going to get Ghost Freak and or Big Chill. So like I said, she doesn't really have any powers, but she has a very bubbly, happy personality, and she made a bunch of ghosts happy when she became one. So I led more into that. So for the colorful personality, I decided Chroma Stone mainly just for the colorful part of personality because his energy blasts are rainbows. Though it's not my favorite alien, but it's colorful and I could see how blocks could make a lot of people happy. Next up, she just warrants having pesky dust. Tell me I'm wrong. Now I gave her gut rot because he can make any chemical compound, so what's stopping gut rot from making laughing gas? I had to give her ditto. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. I had to give her ditto. And especially having the voice of Yakko Warner, it, it, it just fits perfectly. I think Jury Rig just fits because he's hilarious. It would be a she, but still, Jury Rig's hilarious. Same thing with Buzzshock. I mean, the Megawatts were laughing maniacally, but still laughing, so it works for me. I really wanted to try and justify giving her Topic, but I, I couldn't. Because Topic's power is just he's ugly and it's fear-based. But the fact that Wrath is just fucking hilarious is why I gave her Wrath. And that is my opinion if Molly McGee had the Omnitrix. Do all the things, have yourself a good day.